welcome in my channel digital world in this video we learn about digital circuit labs in which we can design and implement four bit comparator so aim is to study and implement four bit magnitude comparator using ic 74 ls 85 learning objectives to understand the behavior and demonstrate the implementation of four bit magnitude comparator using ic 74 ls 85 to apply knowledge of the fundamental gates to create truth tables and to develop digital design buildings and troubleshooting skills procedure to design four bit comparator the first point place the ic on ic trainer kit second connect vcc and ground to the respective pins of ic trainer kit third implement the circuit as shown in circuit diagram fourth connect the inputs to the input switches provided in the ic trainer kit next one connect the outputs to the output leds next one is apply various combinations of inputs according to the truth table and observe the conditions on leds next one is note down the corresponding output readings for various combinations of input and the last one is power off trainer kit disconnect all the wires connections and remove ics from ic base so these are the different steps you should follow to work with four bit comparator this is the circuit diagram so first we learn about ic 7485 this is 16 pin ic so pin number 8 is ground pin number 16 is vcc this is four bit comparator so there are total four inputs are there a0 a1 a2 a3 first input that is a that is of 4 bit next input is b that is b0 then b1 this is b2 and this is b3 so a is of 4 bit and b is of 4 bit so in so first one is this is the circuit diagram first connect pin number 8 of ic 7485 to ground and pin number 16 is connected to vcc next one is there are two inputs a that is of 4 bit from a0 to a3 so connect pin number 10 12 13 and 15 to input switches next input is b so there are four bits b0 b1 b2 b3 so connect pin number 9 11 14 and 1 to input switches next one is there are total three outputs are there pin number 5 6 and 7 as per ic phi is a greater than b this is output pin so here it is written o a greater than b pin number 6 is output a equal to b so this is a equal to b pin number 7 is a less than b so this is a less than b right in addition to the these pins there are three cascading pins are there so these are represented over here pin number 2 3 and 4 so in our circuit diagram pin number 2 and 4 both are connected to ground and pin number 3 is connected to vcc so this is simple circuit diagram of four bit comparator inputs are connected to input switches and outputs are connected to output leds this is the truth table of four bit comparator few conditions are written over here in, in first condition A0 to A3 all are zero and B0 to B3 all are zero so it shows that A is equal to B condition is satisfied and the rest of the two conditions are false so you can write here zero zero and A is equal to B this condition is true so LED connected to A is equal to B that will be glow next one is A is zero you can see here A0 is zero A1 is zero A2 is zero, A3 is zero. But in case of B, all bits are one. It indicates that A is less than B. So LED connected to A less than B will glow. So it will be one. 
and the rest of the two conditions are 0. Next one is we have to know the A input that is of 1, 1, 1, 1 and B is 0, 0, 0, 0. It shows that A is greater than B. So, A less than B condition is 0, A equal to B condition is 0 and A greater than B condition is 1. So, in this way first we have to draw, write this aim, the second one is write the, draw the circuit diagram and write the truth table. Now, in the next part we will see how to implement the same circuit diagram on board. This is IC7485 comparator IC. This is 16 pin IC. Now we have to do the connections. For this purpose, pin number 16 is connected to VCC and pin number 8 is connected to ground. Black wire is used for ground, red is used for VCC. Now connect inputs A0, A1, A2, A3, skip 1, B0, B1, B2, B3. Now connect one wire to A0, it is connected to pin number 10. Next one is connect A1 to pin number 12, connect to second switch. Take third pin that is pin number 13 and connect it to A2. And the last one is pin number 15 that is connected to A3. So this is our first input A0, A1, A2 and A3. Now connect B0 to pin number 9. Next one is B1 to pin number 11. Next one is B2 to pin number 14. Take one wire. B2 is connected to pin number 14 and B3 is connected to pin number 1. Yes. Now there are three cascading pins are there. So first take one wire and connect pin number 3 to VCC. Next one is 2 and 4 short and connect to ground. So take black wire and connect it to ground. The last one is there are total three outputs are there A greater than B, A less than B, A equal to B. So first connect A greater than B to pin number 5. Next one is A equal to B, it is connected to pin number 6 and A less than B, it is connected to pin number 7. So this is connection. Initially, both A and B, both are equal. So A0 to A3 is 0, B0 to B3, all switches are 0. So output is 0. Now we make A is equal to 1. So this is A greater than B. And next one is make A0 and B is equal to 1. Then this condition is A less than B.